anchoring elements is easier than ever with CSS anchor positioning. The Compute Pressure API helps to optimize the available computer power, a storage access API is expanded for more than cookie storage, and there's plenty more. I'm Adriana Jara. Let's dive in and see what's new for developers in Chrome 125. Displaying an element anchored to another element is useful to create UI patterns, like using a popover as a tooltip and having it attached to the element that invokes it. With the CSS anchor positioning, you can tether an absolutely positioned element to one or more elements on the page in a declarative way. It doesn't require JavaScript and works performantly when the anchors are scrollable. The API includes a large number of CSS properties. So a few key properties are anchor name, position anchor, the anchor function, and inset area. To learn all the details about anchor positioning, check out the link in the description. The Compute Pressure API offers high-level states that represent the CPU load on the system. When optimizing for a balanced use of computer power, this API uses the right underlying hardware metrics to ensure that users can take advantage of all the processing power available as long as the system is not under unmanageable stress. Intel let the design and implementation work for this API, which will let video conferencing apps dynamically balance features and performance. Check out the link in the description for examples and more information. The Storage Access API is a JavaScript API that was created as an alternative for embeds that depend on loading cross-site resources. It requests access permission from the user on an as-needed basis. This version includes an extension to the API to allow access to unpartitioned cookies and non-cookie storage in a third-party context, for example, for IndexedDB or local storage. Visit the article in the description for use cases, samples, and more details. And of course, there's plenty more. There's an origin trial for the Device Posture API and the Viewport Segments Enumeration API. CSS added the stepped value functions round, mod, and rem. The Shared Storage API now supports running cross-origin worklets without having to create an iframe. All the details, including links, docs, and specs, are in the post linked in the description. Hit the subscribe button now so that you don't miss the latest Chrome DevTools video, the CSS podcast, and more. Yo soy Adriana Jara, and as soon as Chrome 126 is released, I'll be right here to tell you what's new in Chrome.